Hi guys, welcome to Real Time Automation. Today we are going to see how the drag and drop works for us. So I have taken an example of this site. So this is the functionality, the source folder we are moving that one into destination one. So again I am going to refresh this one. So guys you can see this is in a frame. First we need to check that how many frames are there iframes are there in this site so i have written a code here like driver dot find element by tag name iframes size we are getting the size and we let let's print how many iframes are there So it is one. So directly it's one means zero I frame zero when it starts from right. So driver dot switch to dot frame index we are taking and size is zero and here uh, he, he, there are two ways in performing this drag and drop. I will show you the two ways also. First initially we will go with the actions 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 driver the reference driver we need to pass here and import actions so drag so you can see here there are two methods here first initially we will show you this method later we will see the next method over there so here we have to source and target so both ids we will pass here driver dot find element by dot id so just close this one here we are going to inspect the source folder source path I mean so you can see ID is draggable here just I will copy that one in the same way I will copy the target um, path here element by dot id okay so you can see here the id is droppable dot build dot perform So we can run this one. Let's execute. See how it works. So this folder should come in a drop here destination target folder yeah so you can see it has moved into this target folder so now test case is fast and i will show you the second way how it can be performed just i will tell you i will comment it out this one here we need to take two um, offset values guys in x equal to um, driver dot will copy the here we need to um, we should have the x and y offsets of the target folder that's mean destination folder so here get location dot get get location dot get x 
in the same way we will take a y offset it is the same but here we are taking the y offset y same we are calling the actions so is equal to new actions and driver here drag and drop instead of first one we will go with drag and drop by here and source will be the same copy this one just what I will do I will take and here we need to pass this x x offset and here we need to pass y offset build dot perform and I will close this one we are going to run this one So now it worked correctly for us. The second way also we are done. So this is all about drag and drag and drop, guys. Thanks for watching my video.